Hey guys, I'm back with another tutorial and today we're gonna learn how to pause the game, resume the game and pause the game automatically when the application is in the background. Pausing the game automatically when the game is running in the background is very important. Uh, for example, if you are planning to launch your game for smartphones then if a call comes or the application is uh, moved to the background and suppose the user has pressed on the home screen then you want the game to pause automatically right now as you can see here this is very useful in this case all right so we have created a new scene over here and let's go and create a node 2d uh, let's name this pause And then let's add the buttons. Add a normal button over here. And we'll just duplicate this. Let's name this pause. And the other one resume. Uh, let's put our text over here. Okay, uh, now let's just enlarge this a bit. Uh, this one too. All right. Now let's attach a script over here. Oh no, let's just save our scene first. Let's save this. All right, now that we have saved our scene, um, we will attach a script here. Let's just name it, let's just name it pausing. All right, great. Okay, now let's attach the, connect the signals of the buttons to the script. We're gonna connect the pressed signal so that we know when the user presses the pause button or the resume button. Let's connect for the pause one. Let's connect for the resume one too. All right. Now we can begin with our scripting. So on ready, we want our resume button to be hidden and only our pause button to be shown. So let's make that. We'll get our pause button and then show it. And then the, we'll hide the resume button. All right. Now that we're done with the ready function. Okay, so what happens when the pause button is pressed? We have to get the scene tree and then set the paused to true and when resume is pressed we have to get the scene tree again and then we're going to set the loss to false. All right. Now we're done for the buttons. Now, uh, in the process function, if get three dot false was true then when the pausing is done we want to hide the pause button and we want to show the resume button and 
if a tree dot false is not true or false then we want to hide the resume button again and show the pause button Alright, so now let's see if our pausing works. Now I have a sample scene over here where I have this sprite which has an animation player which loops like this just so we can see that the game has paused or not. Alright, um, we're gonna instance our pausing scene here. Now let's play. All right. Uh, it has paused, but it's not resuming again. Now, the reason is, you go to our pausing scene again, go to the inspector and go to the pause option, the pause mode, and then it is selected to inherit. Now, what happens is, the entire thing is paused. Even, even this process is paused. Now, what we want to do is set the pause mode to process. If we set the pause mode to process for this node, then this node and its children will process even if the other scenes are paused or the other nodes are paused. Now, let's see if this works. Yep, this works as expected. But as you can see, when I click outside, the application is in the background, but the game is still running. We don't want this. Now, for this, what we have to do is go back to the script and we're gonna type in function notification what? We're going to set this to void. Now, we're going to check if what, I mean the notification, that is the variable in the argument that we have over there in the function, what is main loop dot activation focus out. Now what this does is it helps us to know if the application has gone in the background or the application is not in focus anymore. Now we're gonna get the tree again and set the pause to All right, so let's see if we run this now. All right, pausing works fine. And even in the background, it should pause automatically. Yep, it does. And there you go, that's it. And now let's just export the APK over here and let's run it in the Android device. Okay, so the pausing works too. Pause and resume works, and let's see when we, all right, let, let's resume the game and go to the background. And then we go back to the application again. Yep, it has paused automatic. So that's it for this tutorial. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video and stay tuned for my upcoming tutorials.